How's it going, YouTube? Yeah, Pat Mac here. We are playing in, I think this is week five, up against QSN for the MDA. This is our level 100 uh, 4v4 doubles league. And uh, yeah, you see on the side there, it looks like. Oh, wait, okay, he does have Palafin. Wait, do I have all six mods? It sure looks like I do. Sweet. Okay, well. I mean, it's it's nice to get it right, but I don't know if that's actually a good thing for me or not. Um, I think I'm just going to leave with Noivern and Weirder. I think it just gives me a good amount of pressure against their team. And then I noticed that their team has like zero rock resist, and we know both their Terra captains um, are Cress and uh, Thunderous, and those are both um, Terra Fairy, so there's literally no rock resist on this team. So I kind of like Black Beauty to just kind of take advantage of that. And then... Dang, am I about to bring zero Terra Captains? Because I feel like Birdbot is still really good too. Um, huh, that's kind of interesting. Uh, I, I think it could work. Um, the alternative is to bring Dundee. Hmm. You know, I kind of like. Oh, let me think here. No, I kind of like Birdbot. Yeah, I kind of like having Birdbot here. Yeah, so this is definitely going to be a faster game plan for this one. Um, we we both have Tailwind, um, and they of course have uh, Prankster Tailwind. So it's likely that they're going to have the fast con speed control immediately, but I'm kind of looking to like match it with Noivern and then to um, use like my speed control uh, later on with um, uh, booster energy speed from, uh, what's the name of this mon? Uh, Iron Bundle. So, definitely looking to do that. And, uh, dang it, I was not paying as close attention to check items. Okay, well, that's that's a little unfortunate. I kind of wish I'd been paying more attention here. I think the play is just to Super Fang, though. I'm just going to hit whatever is coming in here, because this one's definitely going to swap, you know? Um, especially after it's been intimidated like this. So I could, like, I could Super Fang. I don't know, I almost want to, like... I almost want to just taunt this mon. Like it's, it's really not that much of a threat. And then maybe I'm just gonna trick the, um, the Palafin, because uh, I feel like it's uh, like Cresselia coming in uh, would be my first guess. So I'm just gonna trick onto that spot. But they protect. Oh, interesting. Okay, that's fine. And they have T Wave. Ooh, and we dodge it. Okay. So we're gonna get the taunt off, which means we won't have to deal with that anymore. But basically, neither one of us really got something from uh, this play, which is kind of cool. Uh, I mean, it's cool for us because the best we got was we got a taunt. Um, I actually think I'm cool with just going for kind of that same play. I could see myself Draco using Draco here as well, um, just like deal some damage. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna Super Fang first. Uh, but I don't think I want to super fang. I really want to super fang that slot. I feel like, I feel like what's coming in. Um, like I feel like it's gonna be good for us to get a trick on that spot, and a super fang. Yeah, see, like this, the swap feels like it makes sense to me, but I feel like it's gonna be Cress. Oh, it's thunderous. Okay, that's fine. I mean, I'm not a huge fan of giving this mon. Um, dang, somebody wants missing their attacks this game. Kind of wild. Um, hmm. Wonder what we get. <laughs> uh, okay, so they, they have a choice card also. That's that's hella funny. Not gonna lie, that's that's hella funny. So we're we're basically both gonna be we traded our choice card for the trick. That's that's hilarious. I love that so much. And then Crest does come in. Okay. Um, I think that's fine though, honestly, because I think now I'm just gonna go for taunt on this. I think. You know, I really want damage. Oh, I can't Draco this. Um. Hmm. I'm focused, Sash, so like that kind of helps a little bit. I almost want to swap Mudsdale though. Yeah, I kind of like just swapping Mudsdale here, and then let's go and trick this Choice Scarf onto Cress. Um. Yeah, because I am actually locked in a trick right now, so <laughs> which is hella funny. Because we, we traded choice scarves between Thunderous. You get a scarf. No, you get a scarf. Anyway. Bob Boy Storm. Okay, cool. 
So that'll be nice. Uh, we, won't, we won't get hit on one of our mons. And we actually... Jesus. Does nobody want to hit their attacks? What is going on? This is so insane. Alright, whatever. Whatever. Well, okay, so that's really the mon that I wanted the Choice Scarf on. I wanted to trick it onto Cresselia. So, this is fine. Okay, if, if they're gonna go for um, Icy Wind, then I'm just gonna go for a Trick Room. I'm like, yeah, that's totally okay with me. Uh, and we have leftovers on Prancer. That's really nice. Okay, so I I would like for Prancer to be around for the late game. Uh, ooh, I could lash out. That would be really nice because this is trick. This is uh, yeah, this is um, it's locked into icy wind, right? Um, I mean the alternative. You know what? Honestly, the alternative is just rock slide, and rock slide is great damage against both of these mons. So I'm just gonna do that. And we're gonna set up Trick Room. They're they're lowering our speed. Um, they're locked into icy wind. Like this is this is a really good scenario for us. I don't really see a reason for me to switch things up. I could have gone on this play for the lash out, which, to be honest, would have been really good damage. Um, and I would have liked that as well. But I don't. I just don't think there's necessarily a reason to do that. Jeez. Okay. Well. Yeah, more uh, more missing on moves, I guess. Uh, I think my play here, I would really like to have um, Prancer around and for the late game. Um, I think I swap into... I don't really want to swap into Noivern, actually, if this is locked into... Um, yeah, I think the play is just to go for this again, and then I think we just go side shield bash on the Thunderous. I do want to make sure that this wand is KO'd. Um, because once that mon goes down, then it makes it a little bit easier for our team. Um, do we know all their mons? I guess we don't know of them. We know... Oh, no, we do all... We know all of them. Yeah, there's no Scyther for this one to start off with. Okay, that's nice. And no Luxray. Yeah, actually, because we do know the four. Alright, that's totally fine. Rock Slide is great damage against both these mons. Alright, that's totally fine. We'll pick up the, the Thunder Scale. So they do still have the Terra Fairy option on Cresselia, I'll just need to kind of keep that in mind. We do get a defense boost here. I don't know if it's worth it. Like, would I want to have the, um, yeah, like, would it be better off for me to have the defense boost or, um, to have the Intimidate for Palafin? And that's kind of the, the decision to make right now. Actually, going to Cress. Wow. Okay, in that case, I'm going to swap Prancer out, I think. Um, honestly, Rock Slide is just fine. Uh, we, we see it doesn't do really do that much damage into uh, Pawn, but uh, it's enough. And then I do really want to keep this Mon around. Um, it's, it's, a, it's very, very important for the late game that I have Prancer and that I have Bird Bot, actually. So, as weird as it is, I'm going to get um, Noivern into Trick Room. <laughs> Which is, I mean, I think I mentioned earlier that like the game plan here was not to go for Trick Room, it was to have a faster game plan. And, oh, it's Focus Ash, okay. Yeah, I definitely missed that when I was looking earlier. So they're gonna have Terra Fairy here, huh? Now, I really wanna make sure that I get as much damage as possible with uh, Mudstale, because this mod is just not good against Palafin. So any damage I can get on these two mods, uh, while I have Mudsdale and Trick Room, it's just, it's honestly just perfect. It's really nice here, so. Yep, T-Wave is unfortunate, but it's what it is. We do need to make sure that we KO the Pong, though, because it's probably the, um, Moonblast who... Huh. Oh, we actually lived the hit. Okay, that's kind of cool. Uh, in that case, I think we just go for another Rock Slide, I think makes sense, and then I think... I would really like to have a taunt on this, huh? We have two more turns of Trick Room, yeah? Yeah, I think it's Rock Slide here, and then I almost think it's just Draco this spot also, because I want the I want Pawn gone. Um, if they have Crest late game, like I don't know, it's not it's not that big a deal, I don't think. Um, but it is oh interesting. Rain Dance. Ooh, so that's gonna be to boost the Paladin damage output. Okay, I want. Okay, that, that, that's good. Okay. I think that's fine, honestly. Um, we're going to take a ton of damage on this last turn of Trick Room. 
with like probably some kind of water crack. Yeah, eh, maybe I just should have gone for Super Fang into the Grisalia, but I just wanted to make sure that I KO'd the Illumise, so it was really kind of me banking on the Illumise. And it's fine, it's not that big a deal. We would have done like half HP to, um, that which we'll call it. And I think now it's just go, I think it's just go Prancer, right? Like, let's get our Intimidate, you know? And then, um, makes us a little bit better against this Palafin. And I think after that, we're, we're just kind of in a good spot, you know? I almost wonder if I should, like, if it's worthwhile to save this one. I really just don't think it is, you know? What, what am I at? I think I'm at plus one boost uh, on defense. That's probably still better for me to just go for um, high horse power, though. That's probably the more damaging move. So let's just high horse power that slot. And then I can lend as well if I remember this is the attack dropping one. Yeah, let's just lend to that spot, too. I do need to make sure I put damage on the Cresselia, though, because it's just bulky. Um, do I actually take the hit? Okay, that's good. Yeah, that's really good. But, um, yeah, now that I'm thinking about this, this is actually not really worth it. I should probably be going for damage on the Cresselia, because I, uh, I have freeze drive, right? Um, from Iron Bundle in the back. I actually take that hit, too. Okay, that's cool. Uh, we're going to lose Mudstale here. That's okay. Because um, I think my play now is uh, damage on the Cresselia. Um, yeah, I think it's just damage, get damage on Cresselia. And then um, we're in a pretty good spot, I think, against the rest of their team. So let's, let's go and do that. Yep, Jet Punch is going to pick up that KO. That's fine. Assume, assume that was going to happen. Um, what's the play now? The play now is a little interesting. Because I don't know how much damage this move is doing. Nothing. Okay. Okay, that's super good. Yeah, that move bust did like zero damage. And we're not doing much to Celia, don't be don't get me wrong, but like uh yeah, this is <laughs> this is a much better situation for us. So I'm just gonna go into Birdbot here. Uh and then I think the play uh, I mean honestly it's just let's just free fry the Palafin. You know what, I kind of want to know if they are... You know, I think I'm going to protect. I'm going to protect Birdbot to start off with. I want to know what the Palafin ha has access to. I pr and I wish I'd been paying more attention earlier on. Um, when I was looking at... Um, like, items when we got the Frisk turn one. If I did, I would, I would know more about the Palafin, but... Um, we'll just see if it has protect. Nope, just got punch. Okay, that's totally fine. This is not going to do very much damage, then. I would imagine that they're going after, um... Yeah, they're going after Birdbot. Yep, that makes sense. And that's fine. Yeah, that does zero damage to Solio, but... I mean, it is what it is, I guess. Uh, I think the play here is let's just KO the Palafin now. Um, and then we'll... We'll 2v1 the Cresselia. So I'm just going to freeze dry here. And then we'll just side field dash. Um, yeah, we'll just actually back here. The Cresselia is the more, is the bigger threat, but if I can make this a 2v1, then that puts me in a pretty good position. Yeah, that's not too much damage, so. We'll pick up our free track KO. No way the Palafin lives that. And then the, the game plan is really just to see, like, can I outlast this Cresselia's uh, moonblast damage? Um... Yeah, it's definitely going to you. Ooh, that's, um... Ooh, we get this bad death drop. Or the special attack drop, too. It's a little unfortunate. I really think that Warder is just going to win this 1v1, though. So, like, it is what it is. Um, I could go for Protect here. On uh, Birdbot. I don't know if it really matters. I could probably just get as much damage as possible. Um, it's probably also just better if I get damage straight up. I don't need to try to go for my most damaging move, which would be Hydro, uh, Hydro Pump. Any damage is going to be good damage. Um, but yeah, Cresselia is just... Yeah. Okay, so they kind of thought I might go for a Protect there. That's totally okay. Um, yeah, I'm just... I win the game if I if I deal damage to them, so I'm just going to deal damage. 
Okay, um, thinking about the next game, if there's anything I want to switch up. Um, you know, I'm honestly not, I'm not sure. I've shown all of my moves for Weirder. Um, we've seen that they have T-Wave as their speed control for Illumise. We've seen Choice Scarf on the Thunderous. Hmm. Trying to think of anything else. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what else I've, what else we saw. We saw Moonblast, of course, from Moonblast and Icy Wind. Okay, so they actually... It actually might be a good idea to go for a Trick Room game plan against their team. You know, now I'm thinking about it. Uh, yeah, it actually might be... Might be a good play to go for that. In which case... Um, Gallows would be pretty good, I think. And then I could, or the hoop unbound, and then I have to have a like a pretty trick room centric game plan, uh, which yeah I think would be kind of good, huh? I think it'd be pretty pretty solid. I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I would want to do. I don't know of anything in particular because I feel like what we what we have is like a. I mean I think the bonds that we have look really good, so it's just a matter of how we want to play it. I could see leading Skeledurge to start off with. I kind of like that idea, actually. And then, um... So maybe I go no... Um... No Bird Bot this time. And no Echo either. So we go... Um... Oh, how do we get... How do we make sure we get Trick Room set up? Because, um... Yeah, well, okay. I think I lead this. And we lead Skeledurge also. We'll play a little bit of a longer game plan to start off with, I think. Um, so it might be Trick Room like after a couple of turns, then we'll set up Trick Room. But I don't think we really need Noivern here. And I don't think... Um, like, as good as uh, this Pokemon um, Iron Bundle is, I don't think I necessarily need it here. I think, I think I'm probably good without it. The difficult part, I think, about this game is trying to decide which of my mons is going to get Terra, though. Mm, and that's kind of a tough choice. I think what we... I mean, what we could do is... Yeah, I don't know. It's going to be a little interesting to, to decide how I'm going to make use of Terra for this match. I have a feeling that I'm going to be Terraing Hoopa, though. I think that's probably the most likely one. The downside, of course, is that if I do Terra Hoopa into water, then I'm going to be used to Thunderous. Uh, this... Seems pretty good for me, actually. Yeah, this seems pretty good. Uh, I think I almost want to just Trick Room straight up. Uh, like, it's weird to say uh, Trick Room with a Choice Scarf, but I think that's actually the best option that I have. And then I think it's just Snarl here. I don't need to try to do any weird plays. Like, just getting Snarl on the Thunderous to drop its, um, its special attack is pretty good for me, I think. I almost... You know what? If they're not leading... Palafin? They might not have brought Palafin. Which would be so good for me. Is there anything that messes the... I don't think there's anything that... Sled bump. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, Snarl is so good for me here. Ow, that's way too much damage. And their Life Orb. Life Orb Scyther. Okay, that's fine. So, Life Orb Scyther... We're going to get Trick Room up, though. I'm going to guess that they're going into... Uh, I don't know, actually. Cresselia. Oh, okay, that's fine. Yeah, because actually Snarl is great against these mobs. Drop both these special attacks. Uh, then we'll go into Mudsdale after we set up this Trick Room. And then we're looking really good. Yeah, so I think my play is now just uh, straight up swap. Yeah, I don't think they brought Palafin. I actually have a very good feeling that they did not bring them on. Yep, and they do have life leftovers. Okay. Getting a trick onto that spot would be really nice, but um, for right now, we're just going to preserve it. Let's we'll go into Black Beauty here. And then the play is... Uh, the play is Torch Song. The play is to buff our, our own damage, right? Uh, options for which one I want to... Which Mon I want to attack. Um, I think either one is fine. Uh, yeah, I think it's just a ramp up damage though, and so I think the damage mon that I'd like to, like the one I want to damage, I think it's Cresselia actually. 
I think it's the mom that I'm a little more scared of. I have a feeling it has Trick Room, so I'm kind of expecting them to reverse it right here. Okay, that's fine. So they have Protect, Icy Wind, Moon Blast. All right. They might not have Trick Room, actually. We'll see. They do have Sledge Bomb uh, on Thunderous, and we know they're locked into that move. So not, not too big a deal. Might get poisoned, but is what it is. Uh, I think the play is just to go for uh, uh, Rock Slides, though. Like, Rock Slides are just so free against their team. Uh, obviously, super effective against the Thunders here. Yeah, I kind of like that play. I don't think there's a reason for me to do anything else, really. So it's just Rock Slide here. And then I think, um, I think I'm think i actually just going to Torch Song this spot. It would be nice if I could just KO that um, spot on their team immediately. I don't think the Torch Song is going to do enough damage, though. If we even manage to hit both of them, which we don't, but this would I actually miss both. Man, this game, this game has so much, so much shenanigans going on. All right, this is what this. Moon Blast will deal very little damage. Oh no, our special attack. What are we going to do? Let's let them too. Okay, so they they think Mudsdale is a big problem. I I mean, I kind of agree with them. I think that Mudsdale looks really good against their team, so. I'm going to try to keep track of Trick Room terms here a little bit. I may uh, consider uh, swapping out... Um, you know, I'm going to Snarl on this one. Because I feel like if we hit both Rock Slides, um, the Snarl will be enough to KO uh, Thunderous. Okay, that's fine. Cresselia? No, it's that one. Oh, interesting. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I mean, this mon is about to have minus two special attack, though. So it's really not putting very much damage out in... We're, we're kind of in a good spot against it, I think. Like, we're not going to be able to KO here, but... Um, yeah, we are we are reducing damage output. And... Yeah, it's just... I don't know. I think this is fine. I think actually that Terra is good for us. Because it just means that now we have um, really good damage against this Cresselia. Oh, okay. Alright, that's fine. I mean, obviously it would be... I would prefer if they didn't use that, but... Oh, uh, we get a flinch too. Dang, this game is so haxy. What the heck? Missing moves? Flinches? All sorts of stuff. Uh, I think our play is to just rock slide again, though. Is it? I don't even think I need to rock slide. Let's just high horse. Uh, actually, I do want to rock slide again. Yeah, let's rock slide. Um, but I think now the play... We're at plus one now. Um, do I want to go for more? I could go for more. Just farm these boosts off of Cresselia. Seems pretty good. Uh, I almost want to just Torch Song over here, too. Yeah, I'm going to go and Torch Song this spot. Yeah, they they both drop. Now, if it's Scyther coming in, then Scyther's going to go. Scyther's going to drop. There's, like, no way. Yeah, this one is so dead. It is not living. Rock Slide will probably just straight up KO. Yeah, exactly. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. And then, um... So, I, I did consider going for, uh... High horsepower, just because it would have been like my most damaging move in general. But uh, I, I had like Scyther as a potential switch in mind, um, even though like, like I just didn't think it was very good for them to do that. But this just gets us more damage. Okay, and uh, I mean this is still this is still really good. Luxray. Ooh. Okay. So now we know they're Mon. So they don't have Pawn, and they don't, and we KO Thunderous. Wait, which one did? Yeah, Scyther's gone too. Oh no, they still have Thunders. There's no Palafin though. There we go. Alright, we figured it out, everybody. Um, and they did go for an Intimidate, I believe I saw. Yep, so we're, we're minus one attack. That's not that big a deal though. Just because I'm just going to high horsepower the Luxray. And then I think our play is just Shadow Ball. The Cresselia. Um, there's nothing that resists this now. Uh... I'm trying to think of, like, do I need to be concerned about either one of these mons in particular? I don't think so. I could also just uh, Shadow Ball the Luxray, and then we'll just reduce them to only two mons. Yeah, let's go and do that, actually. I see wins okay. Not that big a deal. Because it's just not doing very much damage. This Cresselli is just... It's at minus two special attack. Like, we managed to reduce its uh, effectiveness pretty significantly. And if we get Trick Room set up again, then it's really not that big a deal. And Crutch is obviously not even dealing that much damage either, so... 
Um, as long as both of our moves hit there, then this this monster dropping. This F drop is pretty cool, but not that not yeah, not that big a deal. Yeah, see now we're I think we we just kind of snarl right, and snarl means that they're dealing zero damage to us. Just because I'm AV, and yeah, I actually think that this this lead looks really tough for them. And just getting Trick Room up was was pretty nice. We're not going to need the um, Weirder anymore, so if I'm feeling like I'm in, kind of in a scary spot here, then I can just kind of swap that one out. But I kind of like just... Um, I think it's just high horsepower this, and then um, Shadow Ball the Chrysalia. Yeah, I got the Fair Blast. Okay, this is fine. This is totally okay. Dude. I don't even think that KOs. Yeah, yeah. Just... AV Mudsdale is just such a beast. This mon has like such good stats and very strong, very very good mon. I'm not even like that um, I don't know, boosted or like I don't actually have that much defensive investment either. Ooh, that almost chaos. Okay, that's good. Uh, I'm cool with just letting uh, Mudsdale go down here, and then I'll go into. Um, I'll go into Weirder, and then with Weirder, they probably just have to focus it, and then I can pick up a KO on either one of our mons here. Um, I'm just going to go for a high horsepower here, and then I think the play is actually just to ramp up our damage a little bit more, so I'll just uh, torch on here. And this is kind of to play around like another Lunar Blessing. This should pick up the KO though, so it still goes down. That's all right. I'm cool with Mudsdale going down. And then I think we're just in a really good spot, though. Yeah, so I'm, uh, I'm wanting to... I mean, I probably could have just KO'd Cresselia here, right? Even with it getting that nice health back. But I think that just Torch Song is going to beat Lunar Blessing um, pretty much every day, you know? And with the KO the Thunders, of course, then, like, now, now we're in a really good spot. Uh, and I think I'm just going to go into Gallows, and I'll Trick Room with that Mon. Um, I mean, actually, I should just attack. I'm just going to attack. There's no reason to do that. Yeah, I'll just... Uh, I'll Terra, and I'll, I'll Trick Room. Oh, no, sorry, not Terra, Trick Room. I'll Terra and Dark Pulse. And then uh, we're, we're just, we're just going to win this then. I mean, I think I've brought... I don't think I've got Magician to proc very many times at all, but I've brought it so many times. Um, I don't know, like, well, I mean, I have to bring Magician for Gallows, but, like, I haven't really... I think I was stolen of a Beery Berry in, like, week one or something like that. Uh, and aside from that, like, I haven't really made use of the ability. I really wanted to, like, I brought Room Service on uh, Hoopa this week, thinking, like, oh, man, I'll just, like... Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll just set up Trick Room and then I'll steal someone's item and that, like, that'll be kind of cool, but yeah, it just hasn't, hasn't come up there, hasn't been a reason to, so, or uh, yeah, just, oh well, I don't know, I'm rambling at this point, good game over to uh, QSN, um, and I don't know, this team is, this team has been pretty fun, I think it has a ton of holes and weaknesses to it, and it's very different from something that I normally draft, but with eight mons, you kind of just like, I don't know. I guess with eight bonds and like this, like I, I feel like my Terra captains are just really strong, and I can bring them pretty much every week. And then I just have some good speed control options. Honestly, the mod that I've loved the most is Weirder. This mod has been really cool. So many options: Intimidate, Frisk, Trick Room, Speed Control, Side Field Bash for Defense Boosts, like all sorts of stuff. So, anyway, if you'd like to see some more of our content, whether it is VGC, Singles, or Masters Draft League, definitely stick around, like, subscribe, and all that stuff. And I'll catch you on the next one.